my guys. Oh, but I the same thought idea at the exact same time. No. A lot of questions about telepathy. What do you think? Ooh, wow. Today I have my twin sister with me here. Hello. This is I am her twin sister. A lot of people are mind blown when they realize there are two of us. So today's video, I'm going to be doing Shelby's makeup. Because I like to consider myself pretty good. Pretty good at makeup. In another life, Monica would be a makeup artist. Maybe. And I've just always wanted to do Shelby's makeup, but she has never let me until today. This video is also sponsored by CVS Beauty. I've done several videos for them, and they're just my favorite place to get beauty and wellness products. Everything that I'll be using on Shelby today and that I have on is from CVS, and I'll have it linked below. And right now is a very good time to stock up on your favorite beauty products or just some new stuff, because right now is the CVS Epic Beauty event. It is on from August 30th to September 26th, so you have a little bit of time to pop into CVS. They do this twice yearly, but this time if you spend $25 on qualifying products, you get a $10 CVS gift card. So, and you get a nice big receipt with even more <laughs> stuff. You know what I'm talking about. Everyone knows what I'm talking about. Oh, yeah. It's not only do you get the gift card if you spend the $25 on qualifying products, but in general, just a lot of your favorite stuff will be on sale from hair care to wellness, to makeup, just all the good things. Everything that I use today, I will have a link below if you want to shop online or you can of course go in store. Okay. Now let's get let's started. Get started. You know, what I've learned with makeup is the preparation is very important for like products just applying well. And I know okay. I don't do that a whole lot. Okay, yeah. well, I know how much you hate, like, your least favorite thing is under eye concealer just not looking good or creasing or any of that. Yes. Shelby hates it. Biggest pet peeve for her. So, I have the Bliss Holographic Foil Eye Masks. We're going to treat you with a little eye mask to okay. start. Okay. These help reduce puffiness and dark circles and have a nice All about that. smoothing effect. Look how cute it is. Oh, cool. Eyes up. Ooh, oh my god, it's cold. Refreshing, right? Yeah. It feel you didn't refrigerate it, did you? No. Okay, so we're gonna leave these on for 15 minutes and then get started. Also, each step of the way, we are going to answer questions you guys sent in because we never filmed together. So let's see, let's see what the questions are. What are Shelby's thoughts about moving to Seattle? Mm. She would love to. Not something I'm no. looking to do anytime soon. Ever though? I just, I don't vibe with the weather, the rain. It just, it really does affect my mood. While you have that in, we can go in on the eyebrows. Let's do it. Do you usually fill them or no? Never. No. Oh, really? Okay, I'll go light. I'll use like a clear gel, but I don't I don't know, I okay. just feel like weird when they're filled. Okay. I'm gonna be using the Maybelline Tattoo Studio Gel Pot. I'm just gonna go really lightly and just kind of follow the line a little bit. I mean, your okay. eyebrows are really naturally, there's just a couple spots where they're like. Yeah, there are a few where it's like, oh, they're, they, nope, nothing. Okay, so. I think they look good. I feel like I tried to like just have them go up a little more. Yeah, shall we do your eyebrow dance? We are ready to rock and roll. And yeah. wow, these are so hydrated. Concealer is just going to go on beautifully. Wow. It actually is pretty glowy. And so for under eye concealer, I actually I got love this from that. you. Yeah. Yes. I saw it in your I've makeup been using bag. That forever. Yeah, this is the A Instant Age Rewind Maybelline Concealer. What other questions did we get? And then I'm gonna use on her for makeup tools. I'm gonna use the GSQ by Glam Squad five piece brush set. I like this because it's so good for travel. They're just nice and little. Someone said, Do you ever disagree on ideas for the podcast? Love it, by the way. I feel like oh, all the time. Do we? All yeah. the time. That's why we do some solo episodes, and it really works mm -hmm. out well that way, because then we can kind of do whatever we want still, and then the ones that we want to do together, we can do together. So, and it, I feel like people like the solo episodes. Like, I loved Monica's last solo episode. It was just funny. Wait, this looks so good. I like to take the concealer out a bit and just make it like a natural highlight. Yes, look at that. I got a hundred hours of sleep. Okay, so next I'm using the Revlon Photo Ready Candid Foundation. It's very well loved by me, as you can see. I mm -hmm. use this every day. Awesome. I mean, it looks pretty good. Somebody asked, what are you jealous of in each other? I'm jealous of how you are smarter than me. Like you just are more of it. Like if we took an IQ test, you would have 
a little bit higher of an I IQ every time. So. I think so. I I'm jealous so. of your editing. It's just like, even no matter how much, I'll think I'll do a really good job editing and then I'll see you're like through something together and it looks so cool. I'm super jealous of your eyebrows right now. I gotta say, I like them. I'm jealous of your jaw. Cause mine's messed up. I'm jealous that you never had to have braces. They That's were just, true. they were just fine. That's true. Who is your favorite influencer right now? Mm -hmm. Dude, probably you. What? I don't know. I like your videos right now a lot. Oh, thanks. Yeah. Mine is probably, I watch all of Matt Diavella's videos. Oh. Moving up to the forehead here. So for me on my forehead, we have like the same face, guys. I have a little wrinkle, which is fine. And so does Shelby. Um, but for me, I just, I try, really do the whole less is more thing with foundation on the forehead so that makeup doesn't like settle into it so I get really 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 light on the forehead makeup somebody asked would you trade your car for Shelby's I wouldn't I like my car I mean your car is the better car but I like I just like having like my car feels like safe to me would you trade I would never I feel like now I would never get a car that's not a Tesla because I'd be like oh it can't drive for me on the freeway Foundation looking so good. Best reaction people have had to finding out your twins slash related. I would just say sometimes people straight up like don't believe it. They're like, no, you're not. Oh yeah, they think no, we're lying. Not. And it's like, it's really not that hard to believe. Or it's just funny how some people are like, so like you are identical. Like you definitely are, or like you're for sure fraternal. Like mm -hmm. people are so sure about it when- And it's- They don't have It is like 50-50 as well. Yeah. Or depending on where we are. Like if we go to Europe together, every Everyone points out that we're twins. It's like, whoa, you guys are twins. But then maybe here in Seattle, no one says anything. But last time I was in LA with you, like so many people pointed out that we were twins. Just a hair color. A hair color can throw people off like crazy. Like yeah. our hair color is like similar-ish right now. So yeah. yeah. A lot of people are asking about podcasting and like it, if it makes a lot of money and stuff. No, it doesn't. It nothing really doesn't. Nothing in life that you first start is gonna make a lot of money. It's like maybe in a couple of years if we stick with it and it becomes more successful. It doesn't get like a crazy amount of views is the thing. No. And like you really need, like if you're getting hundreds of thousands, millions of views, then you make a ton. Mm -hmm. But where ours is, it's like uh, the time honestly is probably better spent working on a YouTube video. Yeah, like I feel like I'm genuinely just passionate about this new medium. You, you can't make an hour long video just sitting and talking. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. but it's nice with podcasts to do that for sure. Now I'm gonna use the Hello Halo Wet n Wild Highlighter and Blush Duo. I'm gonna use the blush in this. Someone said, do you guys plan on living together at one point in time? We do so that I have a live-in makeup artist. No, I'm kidding. Yeah, I mean. No, we don't really. I wouldn't fully say like, it's never ever gonna happen again. Like it could, but we definitely need a really our room to spread out. Like as we keep growing into adulthood and it's like not that that healthy to live with your sibling for super long. So if we were to do that, we'd need like a house. And then for highlight, I'm using just this e.l.f. baked highlighter. These are super pretty, super inexpensive. Like you do not need to buy a $30 highlighter. Okay, someone said, do your other siblings seem to be jealous of y'all's relationship? I don't think they really care. I think growing up, we have a sister that was kind of like the middle child, but honestly, like we weren't growing up, we weren't like super attached to him. No, we're like, always in different classes and stuff. <gasps> oh no. What? Oh, I messed up. <gasps> I put bronzer right there and it looks really bad. Hold on, let me fix it. Monica! I'm gonna do my everyday lip on you. I like to use the NYX lip liner in 810 natural. If you weren't a YouTuber, what would your career be? Kind of like inspired by Selling Sunset. I like, <laughs> want to be a real estate agent now. <laughs> or an interior designer or the um, founder of an underwear line coming to a store near you soon. It was my idea though. No, it was not. Yeah, this is the number one thing that we argue about, actually. We both are just coming up with brilliant ideas all the time. And Monica's that happens to be the own. No, when just they're because not. we both came up with I the same idea at the exact same time. No. Oh, what's one thing you like to splurge on? Every great once in a while, I will splurge on an expensive slice of brie cheese. 
Monica's splurges on interior furniture. I splurge on pretty much everything. Yeah. One thing I started splurging on when I could afford it was lights at better times of day. I do not ever want to take a super early flight. I'll pay like $50 more. And on top of that, I'm obsessed with these. This is the L'Oreal Paris liquid lipstick. Like liquid lipstick, but they're very lightweight. Ooh. A lot of times li liquid lipsticks are like too thick and then they get gross looking on your lips. Super lightweight. This is actually technically a lip stain, but it still feels creamy, like more like a liquid lipstick. So I'm obsessed with these. Oh, it smells good. Finally, onto the eyes. The beautiful eyes. A lot of questions about telepathy. <laughs> it's not a thing. Let's knock this one out. <laughs> one thing I like to do with the eyes is I'll use a concealer with a very, very thin angled brush to um, just kind of line under the eyebrow. It really makes it pop and it oh naturally my. highlights it. I'm using the Essence Earth Eyeshadow Palette. Super pretty. I kind of want to add the greens. Oh my God, I'm going to do the greens. It's going to be really pretty. So I'm adding just this really pretty dark green into the outer corner. Me and Shelby both have very small faces and small eyelids, so you know, doing eye makeup isn't always the easiest. Ooh, I like that. So all these colors in this palette are very shimmery, so it's nice that the highlight color is matte. It's fun and a little bit more like a night out look, but it also, like you could wear this during the day because it's still pretty neutral colors. This is the Inspired by K Beauty brand, and this is their gel eyeliner called Make Her Jealous. It is so creamy, um, but when I put eyeliner on other people, I like to actually put it on an angled liner brush and then do it, it's a lot easier. Yeah. In fact, I usually do that with myself. Just go like that, this is what I do usually. I like it. I think my work here is done. Here we go. Most important part, what do you think? Ooh, wow. I like the eye look is like a lot, but it's cool. I feel like my skin looks way better than when I do my foundation. I think yeah. the highlighter looks so good. It's like funny though, cause I'm just not used to it, but I think you did a good job. So, I mean, the real question is, would you let me do your makeup ever again? It took a long time. But I probably good. would for like a- Like um, a wedding? Yeah. Like I said, everything that I use, you can find at CVS. I will have it linked below. Thanks again to CVS Beauty for sponsoring today's video. And also listen to our podcast. We have a podcast together. Yes. That is the one thing- Millennial Life Crisis. The one thing that we do do together. So yeah. We'll have the link below as well. And we probably answer a lot more of the questions that people are asking on Instagram just in the podcast already. Totally. So check. All right. Thanks for watching. See and we're going to go take photos of my face. Okay. Bye. bye.